Hi everyone, this is Britt of Britt in Toyland coming to you with another Star Wars Black Series action figure review. And this one is going to be for Dr. Aphra. Uh, I finally bit the bullet and uh, got this for myself for Valentine's Day because I'm worth it. Um, but yeah, this one I wanted for a while. I purposely waited until they did like they announced their uh, archive waves for the year. Wasn't really expecting her to be in it, but uh, she wasn't, so I decided now is the time to uh, get her off the secondary market. Very expensive, of course, but uh, excited to have her. Um, quick side, Dr. Afra. These were never the most interesting boxes, but uh, yeah, I'll just quickly read off her... Uh, Bio. On a mission gone wrong, Dr. Aphra finds herself at the hands of the formidable Sith Lord Darth Vader. A rare survivor of such meetings, Aphra is recruited by Vader for her skills in reprogramming droids and her apparent lack of remorse for breaking the law to get what she wants. And she's number 87 in the line. Alrighty, so we'll open her up and take a look. Okay, so here she is out of the packaging. Uh, first thing I'll notice, she is so skinny tiny, she feels kind of fragile, but uh, looks really good. You can see she's got her cybernetic tattoos on her arm. Outfit looks good with her little dark vest, her gloves. Boots make it look kind of fancy just the way the toe is pointed here. Um, not full on rocker ankles. Well, maybe a little bit. Uh, we've got a double joint at the knee, ab crunch. The head's a little stiff, but you get your up and down, side to side movement. I think her face sculpt is uh, really nice. I think it captured her likeness well. Back to the side. Uh, you got your joint at the elbow. And they go uh, out at the shoulders and 360 around. You also get a thigh swivel. Yeah, it's looking good. Um, here is her little aviator helmet. It's kind of weird that she doesn't have it on. <laughs> so we're going to scoot that on right now. Yeah, there's Dr. Afra. Yeah, she looks good now. Now she looks correct. And she comes with her uh, little blaster. It's a, it's a generic one. She doesn't have like a anything too fancy. But she's, uh, yeah, she's good. I'm quite pleased with this purchase. Uh, let's just see how her uh, blaster comes in. Oh yeah. Oh, finger. Okay, hold on here. She's so delicate, <laughs> which is crazy given the character who is not a delicate person at all. But I mean, it fits in well enough. I just gotta figure out her trigger finger. But it fits, which is good. I'm gonna take that out though. And put it in her holster. And it fits quite nicely. So, I'm very impressed. Glad to have her in the collection. Uh, now that they've been doing more comic characters, I'd love to see them do uh, Magna Tolvan and Sonisteros to go along with her. And definitely want to pick up Triple Zero and uh, BT1 at some point when I have the funds to do so. But yeah, this has been Dr. Afra for the Black Series. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.